All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra's Lair. I'm your host, Larry. We're back for more of that something retro show where we play old games and go insane. Isn't that so much fun? Um, what's what's my name again? Uh, Dearth? Dearth. Dearth, because you that's, died. That's you got torn in half by chimpanzees and eaten when you went outside. I, I, I prefer to be called Dearth the Second now. Did you get torn something in half happened. again while I was outside working? <laughs> I, it's it's a mystery. I'm dead now, or I was. I mean, you don't you wouldn't remember. You just know that you woke up in cryotube number two, and you're just like, well, shit. Yep. Hmm. Is there? I think look up the secret garden too. By the way, we I've, found that weird garden. I've, I've looked it up, but I it's not on this wiki. I'll look up another wiki. Just Google it. Why are you on the wiki looking? Just Google it. Google's faster at finding shit on I, people's I just, own websites. You're right. Which oh, is really moon, dumb that's, that's... that we haven't mastered searching in this day and age, when the, the age of search giants. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go Are bribe- large. I'm gonna go bribe that whore that I like with this delicious turnip. Oh, the secret garden behind your house shows the number of power berries you have eaten. Which are the red apple-like objects oh, you find shit. in there. Oh shit, I've eaten like, almost half of them. Nice. Thank I'm pretty you. sure there are delicious. in the game. You're welcome, lady, with the, 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 the tots that I enjoy. Oh, and you've <laughs> liquored me up again. Fantastic. Excellent. Alright, I'm gonna get liquored up again, and I'm gonna read her diary. And tank my happiness oh, into boy. the hole. All right, She's there probably we go. not even two star happy. She better be at this point. I have given her the turnips she she so very much loves and enjoys. <laughs> and then she saw me go into her bedroom and read her shit. <laughs> Definitely not creepy. We are creepy. up to two. Oh. We are up to two now. Oh boy, making progress. I'm gonna go celebrate by getting turbo drunk and like pretending I'm a sprinkler in the woods. Oh, oh. I also I was right. It was five hearts. Five for not what? For being able to marry them. Did I ask that? Yeah, like, a really long time ago. Huh. Okay. That's cool. Yep. Yeah. Also, you need a blue feather to marry them. Where Just the hell do you them. get a blue feather? Either the hawker or the peddler. I'm not sure which one. You show up at his house and you start throwing shit against the wall. Where's the blue feather, <laughs> old man? You have to go through the ritual of the dancing fire. I don't have time. <laughs> like, okay, that's fine. I didn't like that antique lamp my father gave me anyway. Oh, no. Let's see. What What is this place about? What is this weird cave? I was about to ask. What's What's in the cave? Um, let's find out. There's a power yep, berry. Good. Don't know how to get the oh. power berry. Says dangerous, easy to collapse. Tell you. How do I get the power berry? I want the power. Ooh! Oh, I found the poison mushrooms. Oh boy! I think I should eat them. Y yep. Definitely. Actually, I can't eat them. I can just pick it up. Darn. I wonder if I can. Can you sell the poison mushrooms? Um. I mean, you can try. Sell poison mushrooms during the slow periods to make money. That's an advice. A piece of advice. Sorry. What does it mean, the slow periods? Um, I think there are certain seasons where... Oh, that's right. The plants change when you go into, yeah. like, summertime. Yeah. Yay. So I guess keep the mushrooms for those periods. I mean, I I guess that's a sound plan. I need yeah. a water shit. God damn it. Stupid plants and your water requirements? Why can't you just absorb nutrients from my victims like all the other alien life forms that I've been stealing from the inter from the internets? Oh. You can just you buy download the internet? No, you just you buy them on Craigslist, Death. Have you never purchased oh. slave labor off of the internet before? I can't say I have. You peasant. <laughs> yes. I bet you've never even started an empire. Oh, I... I mean, I've tried, I just... it didn't work out. Oh! I think you need to go into the cave... wait, hold on. 
After the earthquake occurs in the first winter, visit the area in the mountains just above There's the entrance. There's more than one winter? Oh, good. <laughs> um, chop the tree to the right of the spring to uncover a hole. Fall down the hole and you will land on a platform inside the mountain cave. Right next to the power berry. I don't know if we're gonna get that far. If we get to winter, I will ask you again for your- for the informations. Alright. I don't know that we're getting past summer, though. This is just taking so long. A very slow game. I mean, I understand I mean, why they did it, and I can kinda understand why people would be into this. Mm-hmm. It's just like, I- this isn't the type of game for Larry, most of the time. It's just super grindy, is what it is. What did I just plant? I don't- I think this is potatoes. I think that's the gray bag. Maybe these are turnips. <laughs> I don't know. We'll find out soon. Keep track, my goodness. Dude, I don't know. I just have seeds. I grow a garden <laughs> IRL too, just, and sometimes oh, I plant- I put seeds together that I usually plant in like a row together anyway. Mm -hmm. And then I just forget, so I end up with like a couple of turnips in the, the radish row. <laughs> Radishes grow great here, by the way, in Colorado. Dude. They are- they are fantastic. Nice. Uh, I guess I'll go try to sell more dead animals to the dude tomorrow. Wait, how do I see... Allocated land for the annex of the house, necessary... How do I know how many materials I've got? Does it not give you a list? Oh, it says I've got, uh, 98 pieces of split logs and collected items. Okay, I guess I'll go back and get the axe and I'll go start smashing things. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh no. Death, do you remember do you have that link to those really kind of dark jokes I sent you? I do. Grab that up. I right. use that. Would you like to hear a joke? Yes. One that's not racist preferably. Oh man. Or only kind of racist. <laughs> we just got to well, hit all the markers if we are a little joke. racist. No no um, offense intended for you folks at home. Maybe oh, a little okay. if you're from the space lizard colony. So, space so this lizards. one is racist, but it goes all out. Or I'm pretty sure it does. does is it? that okay? Uh, yeah, I'm sure it's fine. Okay. We mean well, no offense unless you're a space lizard. Space lizards can <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> of course. What does an Ethiopian do in the dark? Starve. Oh, you read that one No, already. I just can't. Every joke I've ever <laughs> made about Ethiopia death has been about starving <laughs> to death. Come on now. Alright, how- okay. Losing my virginity was a lot like how I learned to ride a bike. My dad had a very firm grip on my shoulders. <laughs> <laughs> that could be either a redneck or just a creepy joke. <laughs> yeah. It's like, the, um, I think I was reading one of them the other day where it's like, What do you call a girl who lives in a redneck trailer park who runs faster than her brothers? Hmm. A redneck virgin. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Incest is funny, tee hee. Ha ha. What's the first? What's the worst part about breaking up with a Japanese person? Um, does it involve the nuclear bombs? You have to drop the bomb twice before they get the message. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. All right, that's enough for right now. We'll share more of those <laughs> next time, probably. Actually, this is one I heard from the, uh, the Let's Try It Out series. What's a rapist's favorite vegetable? What? Beetroot. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so bad! That's horrible. Oh. It's supposed to be allegedly Bill Cosby root, too. You plebs. <laughs> Quality. Sulfur spring. Benefits rheumatism. Recovery- Oh, you're right! I can get my stamina back from being in the hot springs yeah. for a while. Sweet, I'm gonna get nude. Mm -mm. Can I not go in at night? What's going on here? The the fishies are there at night, probably. Oh no, I had to hop over the thing. <laughs> oh. oh, so relaxing. Um, what's been in the news recently? PC gaming. I know I was watching the uh, music awards, and Justin Bieber had them. I didn't even realize it was Justin Bieber because I tuned in. To it, and like there were just people dancing in like this rain puddle in the middle mm -hmm. of the stage, like a giant pool what? getting all pointlessly wet. And I'm like, that's the dumbest thing I've ever seen. All right. And it was the most generic song I've ever heard. It was just kind of like generic pop. It was like, uh -huh. oh, it's Justin Bieber. I'm like, what? 
<laughs> what? Wow. All right. I mean, I guess that's one way to fade out quickly. <laughs> oh, but he's he's turned into not a shitty person, at least. There's Has that. Has he? Has yeah. he really? Like, like after his roast, he start he started becoming like. Shortly less after of a his roast, bag. he did that thing where he almost killed some people drag racing and got arrested. Oh God! Did he really? Yeah, he's like on drugs and drag racing. Almost oh. hit some pedestrian. That's not good. So after that, I was just like, "What an asshole!" Yeah. Although right after that happened, some other pop star who was in the hotel room above his spit on him while he was on the balcony below him. <laughs> that was nice. great. I loved that. <laughs> oh my god, there's a raccoon! Slay the raccoon! Slay it! Come back! Don't kill the raccoon! Raccoons are vermin death, you don't let them live. You hit them oh, with a okay. shovel, and you bury them I in see. your backyard. <laughs> oh. But not the pet cemetery. You know how annoying zombie raccoons are? They're constantly trying to eat the brains of other raccoons. Actually, no, that's actually a beneficial thing. <laughs> I was gonna say. Bury them in the pet not... cemetery. <laughs> how many pieces do they only do I... become zombies there? I don't know. I don't own a pet cemetery. You could just be able to oh. put them in a regular cemetery covered in demon's blood. I don't know how that works. It, that's good. I, that's a good point. I'm guessing that, that the earthquake you mentioned is how I move this boulder to get at those free flowers over here. Mm-hmm. That could be it. S stupid taunting flowers. Forcing <laughs> me to buy your brethren to give to the pink-haired chick. <laughs> so apparently, uh, I also figured out that that one chick, these, these, these things in here aren't weeds. They're just, um, they, well, they were listed as weeds in one of the two wikis, first off. And second uh -huh. off, uh, the pink-haired chick just doesn't like f beautiful flowers from the woods. Even though she claims to love <laughs> springtime flowers and looking at them in the woods. So she only accepts um? pure Aryan flowers. <laughs> well. The racist. The racist flower what keeper. What an a-hole. <laughs> Alright, I'm just looking, I'm trying to find, like, info in news. The only thing that's kind of in the news is that while the new Battlefront, Star Wars Battlefront, is an okay game, it's actually kind of boring. And I'm not super surprised. I thought I mean, people thought it was kind of shitty. Some- Oh, I guess I'm tired. I gotta go eat another berry and put it in my mouth. Oh. Um, I thought it was okay, but my main thing was, like, it felt really small, and uh -huh. you had, like, no kit to play with, no guns to really unlock, besides a handful. Isn't it only the, like, was it in alpha or beta? That was like the beta right before launch. Oh, right before launch? Wow, that's kind of lame. And for the most part, there was only like two weapons that were any good out of like the four or five you could use. Everyone wow. pretty much used the same general layout for their weapons, and that was it. That's, that's really boring. Yep. And people got surly. I guess I'm done <laughs> gathering stuff for the night. I just get too tired after a while. Collapsing all over the place. I'm gonna go get some shit and smush in that other girl's face tomorrow. Alright. That sounds like a thing adults do. Yeah. Just smushing all their faces. What's you drinking, Death? Oh, water. Just boring old water. Definitely not vodka. You're not even 20. Get out of here with your that's why, sauce. That's why, that's why I said it wasn't vodka. I don't know, anytime I hear definitely not something, I'm always suspicious <laughs> immediately. More, more bright sunshine, fuck off with that stuff. Alright, well, I need to buy seeds tomorrow, first off. Do they still have potato season? It's spring, they don't change till, uh, summertime. Mm. It's the 17th, getting close to the fair. I think Festival. for the fair, or, whatever. Festival fair. <laughs> it, it, it's a tiny podink farming village, dude. Would you really call it a festival? I, really? I think you can call anything a festival. Alright. Well, there was a flannel festival tonight at, at the restaurant, so there was that. <laughs> yeah, I had a flannel. My friend had a flannel. Oh, the dude who was talking to us that worked there had a flannel. We're just like... <laughs> I just got Flannels up and I'm like, the greeting of flannel aficionados has come to an end. <laughs> Farewell, <God>. brethren. 
Uh, there's that creepy old guy who's the father of that one chick. Hey! Tell your daughter to be more into me. <laughs> That's something a father should do. Yeah, that goes over well. When your parents try to set you up. Yup. I guess this shit that grows in the woods changes in the summertime. Oh, Don't be cool. able to, to smush berries in that one chick's face, which is the whole reason why we decided that we may need to switch to... What was her name? Heather? I think it was like... Anne? Wasn't it? No, it's not Anne. Anne's the blonde one. Oh, it... I... I can't find it. She's not... I, I don't or know. Or like I've the dirty it. blonde one? Whatever. It was a brown-haired one. Oh, that... Let's see here. Where are you, Frowny Brownie? She was in the restaurant. Oh, is she this chick? The one behind the bar? Mmm, let's see. She's like a yeah. meaty Dutch woman. <laughs> uh, don't know. Yes, I don't know about this anymore. Yeah, if this plan is all falling oh, apart. Ellen, wasn't it? Oh yeah, Ellen DeGeneres. I remember now. Yeah. Wait, maybe it was this- is this- what's your name? Uh... What's this other chick over here that works at the animal place? Hmm. Wait, can I buy a chicken? <gasps> Wait, maybe it's finally time. Give me the chicken. No, don't go out the door! You stupid bastard with your stupid ankles. We want the chicken so that we can threaten it with death every day. <laughs> threaten it with me or, like, killing it? <laughs> Oh wait, this is, uh, this is feed for the chicken. What does this ledger say? Wait, hold on. Livestock note. Cow, chicken, milk... Oh, this is like info on them. What great notes. It's like leaves like pamphlet out on the floor. Hey, what, do <laughs> what can I do for you today? I wanna buy a chicken, old man! A chicken costs a thousand dollars, do you want that one? Why, yes. It's outside, so take it with you. It'll eat grass by himself, so let it- just let it be. Outside. Right. But once it's in the pen, feed it properly, you little bastard. Look up the chicken's care. Do I have to put this thing in- inside- oh, it's on the other side of the frickin' place. Do I have to put it inside when it rains? Um, let's see. Animals. No, Teach me about the, the satanic chicken. Chickentron. We've now named the chicken as Chickentron. What an excellent name. Come, Chickentron. Away! Look at my booty jiggle. Look at it. <laughs> yes, Chickentron. You must feed them one unit of fodder each day. If you can't feed it your own fodder, you can buy a bag of chicken feed at the livestock for store. Um, know. If you miss a day, they will stop laying eggs for three days. Each additional day you miss will increase the time by each well, day. Well, they say they'll eat themselves outside. Oh my. So... It doesn't say anything about leaving it out. So, I, I'm Maybe pretty sure it doesn't matter. I better put it inside. It's getting a little late. What does it say about putting them outside? The dude said um, you could put it outside. Chicken, if you yeah. die, I'm gonna beat your corpse even further to death. Is your dog still outside? Yeah. I'm, I'm pretty sure that there's nothing gonna happen to your chicken then. If okay. nothing happens to the fences, at least. I think the fence is pretty okay. Let me bash the remaining kind of damaged parts of it, just to be certain. Hmm. Uh... Boop. 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 Cows are 5,000 gold, my goodness. They better be worth it or I'm gonna murder them. <laughs> you can get a golden cow. Oh, I forgot to buy seeds, oh well. Whatever. It's just more work to keep the seeds alive! Ugh. This is why I have a drip hose for my garden, because fuck watering. Let's put <laughs> it on a timer system and I can just let it go. That works. But it's not as efficient, Larry. I don't care. The plants are still alive, they grow just fine, I give them miracle grow. The tomatoes make a blood pact with me to produce tomatoes or die. It's fine. <laughs> Tomatoes make a blood pact. You've never made a blood pact with tomatoes, Death? I thought you said is, you were a farmer in a past life as a non Is that because they're red? Oh wait, that's right, I forgot to, uh, finish breaking down this... this boulder. Ah. Oh. Actually, there's some... 
There's some knowledge or study about tomatoes that you're supposed to like put down a piece of red plastic and they grow better. Hmm. Uh, that just said that seriously sounds like a load of bullshit. Aren't tomatoes berries technically? I I don't know. You look that up for next time. All right. And that's it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. We have a chicken. And yeah, that's all you need to know. So goodbye. <laughs> Ritual has been completed.